Confectionery is the most profitable segment of any successful bakery. Using Supreme's plain sponge prepared mix, your bakery will be able to produce a variety of delicious confectionery products. By simply adding water and eggs to the plain sponge prepared mix, your bakery can produce consistently superior cakes like vanilla sponge, Swiss roll, sponge slabs and lamingtons. I'm now going to show you how to make a Swiss roll. A Swiss roll batter is a two-step process. First we add water. Then we add our eggs. Lastly, we add our supreme plain sponge prepared mix. You'll notice there's still one bit of water left. This goes in at the end after you've mixed the sponge. The first part of the mix is just like any other sponge mix. Put it into the machine, mix it on slow speed for about a minute just to incorporate all the ingredients and then put it onto high speed and mix for between 5 to 7 minutes until the batter is doubled in volume. Once the batter is doubled in volume, we take it off the machine, we put it on the table, we add our second part of water and we fold it in by hand. I've now finished whisking the sponge batter. Now I'm going to add the second part of water and just fold it in by hand. Now I can put the batter into a pre-lined baking sheet. You'll notice I've put a bit of pan release underneath the greaseproof paper. It helps it just to keep the greaseproof paper in place while you start pouring the sponge mix in. You spread it evenly around the pan. Getting it right into the corners. Don't worry if it's not completely flat. Once it goes into the oven, it will settle down. This batter is now ready to go into the oven. The use of Supreme prepared mixes will save your bakery both money and time as they reduce wastage and improve your baking yields. Supreme also offers a dedicated technical service team, which means you have access to baking specialists who have a wealth of knowledge. We've just finished baking the Swiss roll. Now we're going to tip it onto this sheet in one very quick fluid movement. Now we need to take off the greaseproof paper. The trick is to pull it at a quite a steep angle here, so as not to break the sponge. Now we're going to cover the back with thinned down apricot jam. Getting it right into the corners, the whole way down. Don't be tempted to put too much apricot jam on, otherwise it won't roll properly and it'll tend to just slide apart. Right, now we're gonna roll up the Swiss roll. First thing you do is start the roll off right at the top. Just bend the edges over, just to start the rolling process off. And grabbing the greaseproof paper and keeping it nice and straight, and putting even pressure on. It's very important to keep the pressure even all the way across. If you pull down on this side, it's going to squash the Swiss roll in. Just keep it nice and even, slowly pulling it towards you, rolling up this back piece as you go. Once you've got it all the way around, tuck the greaseproof paper underneath Smoothing it out, just allow it to stand just for two minutes, just so the structure can set. The 
Then we have a pretty good Swiss roll. Now we're going to cut the Swiss roll into pieces. First thing to do is cut off the edge. And that's what your Swiss roll should look like after rolling. Supreme will not only deliver consistent quality baked products, they also support the growth and profitability of your bakery by providing personalized baking solutions. Supreme Plain Sponge Mix is extremely versatile in the baking of all sponge based products like plain sponges, Swiss rolls, there's some really nice decorative feathering work here, plain and chocolate Swiss rolls, Victoria sandwich sponge, and lamingtons. For these and other sponge mix recipes, business tips and industry news, review the Supreme website.